is not going to be just about cars, it's going to be about mobility. My name is uh, Olivier Sapin, I'm uh, working at Dassault System. I'm the global lead uh, for the uh, transportation and mobility sector. We are partnering with the automotive market in India for many years already. Uh, and uh, we are working with all the different OEMs and uh, suppliers in India. Uh, this is a very uh, strategic market for us. Uh, and um, there are many uh, uh, challenges at the moment. And especially, uh, you know, uh, India is trying to catch up uh, in terms of maturity uh, on safety on emission uh, with the global standards. So for example, Barrett 6 is going to be uh, one of the critical milestones. Every single OEM is challenged with that regulation and uh, we are here to, to partner and to help with them. We are bringing efficiency on the traditional uh, uh, cars, but we aim to uh, invest a lot on the electric vehicles. So you saw that announcement with Mindra Electric so basically what we are doing with them is that we increase uh, their capacity uh, to uh, virtually simulate uh, the electric vehicles. And you know, when you are dealing with electric vehicles, obviously there are new components like e-motors, uh, battery, and, uh, I, and I think it's very important to master uh, these simulation disciplines to make sure that you are uh, not only becoming more efficient, but you are providing a, a product that is reliable. We saw that uh, already last year there was more than uh, 1 million vehicles uh, electric uh, which were sold uh, worldwide and uh, we see a strong push on uh, electric uh, vehicles. Uh, it's not yet a reality on the, on the, on the market, but uh, uh, it will evolve uh, rapidly and we can uh, foresee in uh, uh, year 20, 23, 24 a big, a big adoption of, of EV uh, globally and, and certainly in India as well. The cost parity between electric vehicles and conventional vehicles uh, is going to be uh, uh, very similar uh, in the, uh, around the year 23, uh, uh, 24. And knowing that when you create a new vehicle, it takes four to five years for a brand new platform, people have to, they have to prepare themselves now. Uh, if you consider the future uh, trends in terms of uh, electromobility, I think it's important for every Indian player to really invest on the complete value chain. Uh, you cannot afford uh, to outsource completely uh, critical components like battery or e-motors. You have to invest uh, or partners uh, in order to learn and to get uh, knowledge, uh, know-how about all these critical uh, uh, systems uh, that you have to deliver. So that, that uh, will be a, a set of technology that are very important to, uh, to master. If I look at the trends uh, in India and uh, uh, very similar to what's happening worldwide, you have uh, major cities and if you think about the population in 2030, uh, we expect that uh, maybe 600 uh, 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 million people will live on, on this city with many urbanization. Uh, at this time, it's not going to be just about cars, it's going to be about mobility, uh, to go from point A to point B. Uh, so, uh, it's going to be critical to get um, electric vehicles not only as uh, uh, one you sell to a consumer but as part of a global uh, mobility system. Oh.